Howdy! Today you will learn how to combine neomorphism with icons in CSS. We will start with an empty HTML file that is linked to an CSS. In this example we will use font awesome for the icons, so we have to link it to our website. Font awesome provides different options on how to link it, or you can just do it like me. Hippity hoppity, this is now my property, and paste it in the header of your HTML file. Here I was lazy so just copy the structure. But if you are wondering what these elements are, just search for an icon on Font Awesome and copy them. And oh, is that a sign you should gently press that like button on this video? Anyway, follow my steps and learn. Or do it the correct way and copy it from the link in the description and leave a sub while doing it. Now visit neumorphism.io, a good website where you can customize and preview the neumorphism effect. This part is up to you, customize the values as you like or just copy whatever I am doing. When you are done playing around like a little kid, copy the background color hex code and paste it to the background property of your body or parent element. Then create a new selector called nm and paste the hex code as the color property. Make sure you use the color property and not the background property. Then add a text shadow but leave it empty. Then add this nm class to all the icons you have on your HTML file. Then copy the box shadow value from the generator on neumorphism.io and paste it to the text shadow. And as long as you can copy correctly and save the files, it should work. Nice job. Leave a like if this was helpful and if it didn't, leave a comment as to why I should care. Have a nice day.